Hey everyone, I'm Lou and you're watching Live Free and DIY. In my last project I made some hangers for my wife's vintage luggage set that she has and the hangers that came with it were broken so she asked me to make her some new ones. I ended up having a little bit of trouble because of the scroll saw combined with the birch plywood. My blades were dulling really quickly and I didn't know why and as I mentioned in the video it turns out that the glue in the birch plywood doesn't really interact well with scroll saw blades and they ended up dulling quickly. So they didn't come out as clean as I would have liked, but they look good enough and they function fine. So I'm happy with that. So I finally finished Quantum Leap, but the last episode is not on Netflix. You actually have to go to NBC's website to watch it. And then I discovered that also the pilot episode and the first episode are not on Netflix. So I went back and I watched the pilot and the first episode, which I had already seen them both a number of times. But it was good just to make it full circle and have watched every episode. The last episode is one of my favorites. It answers a lot of questions, kind of. But it does end in a pretty ominous note, but the series is, was really good. I really enjoyed it. So since I finished Quantum Leap, I started watching Veep, which is on HBO. Uh, it's really funny. I'm on the second season already. The seasons are fairly short, and they're only half-hour shows. I actually met Tony Hale a few months ago, and he plays the assistant to Julia Louise Dreyfus, who is the vice president in Veep. So it's pretty funny. It's a comedic look at politics in the United States. It's, it's, it's really good. I don't know if you saw it, but a couple of days ago, Izzy Swan put out a video of a pump cart uh, scooter that he made. It is really awesome. It's probably one of my favorite videos that I've seen this week. It looks really fun. It's something that I think my kids would really enjoy. They would probably fight over it, like his kids were fighting over it in the video. So I'm going to put a link to that in my description here. Check it out. It, it was a really fun video to look at. I can't wait to see his build video, which I assume will be coming up soon. I kind of linked a picture on Instagram of a project that I worked on this weekend, and I'm going to put out a video of that next Tuesday. My wife had bought a paper mache deer head from Hobby Lobby and asked me to mount it as if it were a real deer head. So I made a video showing how I mounted it. I'll post that video on Tuesday. As you can see, I shaved my head. I did that today, actually. Um, I had messed up my hair a little bit, and I just wanted to start from scratch, which is going to be a pain, because it's going to take a year to get it back to where it was, I think. But uh, I'm going to actually start going to a barber to get it done. I was doing it myself, and I ended up messing up, and I cut it too short on one side and I just said that's it I'm gonna start all over again so I think that's about it for this vlog I really appreciate it I got a ton of subscribers last week which was totally awesome if you like my videos please share them and don't forget to click the subscribe button uh, check me out on Instagram like I said I'm also on Twitter and Facebook but I'm mostly on Instagram and you can fill out my contact form on my website, and I'll get back to you no matter how you contact me as soon as I can. Thanks again for everything. I appreciate you guys, and I hope you have a great weekend. Bye.